guys today i'm sharing with you this bobby boss wig that i did pick up on wig types i have her in the style mlf 720 yanika and in the color tthl 414613 phew that was a lot to say here i'm showing you the specialty colors that she also comes in uh, this wig is part of their wear and go line She's a center part wig. She has a three and a half inch uh, parting space in the front and she does have the standard wig cap construction which I'm sharing with you right here. Now this is just me showing you uh, how she looks directly out of the packaging. So, um, so far so good. I love the length and I'm impressed with how she fits on my head. Here in a second, I'm gonna show you how far she does come down on the sides for me. So initially, um, I think she's pretty good and I love this color. I'm going to uh, come back and give you my first impression in just a moment, but here, this is just your first peek at her directly out of the box. Okay, you guys, I am back with her on my head directly out of the package, and I like her. I love this color combination. Let me just say shout out to Bobby Boss for the dark root. The dark root on this wig is absolutely stunning. Um, I feel like they did a really good job of kind of putting it through and through. Sometimes it's just like dark at the right here at the part or just at the top. But um, yeah, she she's not dark all the way through, but they, they came pretty far down with it throughout the front perimeter of the wig. So I'm loving the dark roots. Um, and just the co color combination itself is really pretty. Um, yeah, I'm really liking this. I love these face framing highlights here at the front. And you know what? I'm liking the length of her. Um, of course, I like a bob, so that is really nice. Um, one thing I will say, this bob is cut really cute. I love the way it kind of, some people don't like this, this little cuffing around the neck, but I like it. I like it. I think it looks really cute. Um, it's very flattering to me around your face. So I like that. <clears throat> and then I will say, this is a nice texture. Um, it's a little bit different than what I thought. It is a natural, it's sort of like a, it's a yakky texture. Um, it's not too terribly shiny. I don't know if it's coming off shiny to you guys in the camera. Um, but this is not as natural yakky texture or blowout texture like the Nisha line, in my opinion. It is a natural feel uh, texture. It's nice and full. It's not a thin bob. I think that the um, amount of hair on here is, is a decent amount of hair on the wig cap, but it's not overly full where it's too thick or too heavy. Um, or it would even, I don't feel like I would be uncomfortable during the summer months wearing this wig either. So this actually looks directly out of the wig. Um, this is the parting space. It's not very deep. Um, in my opinion, it says it has a three and a half or 3.5 deep part. It has natural baby hair, which you can see here. Um, and it does come in a lot of specialty colors. So y'all, again, this is, um, Bobby Boss, part of their wear and go. Uh, wig line. I have her in the style MLF 720 Yanika and my color or the color that I am sharing with you guys is TTHL 414613. Okay, that sounds like a prison number. <laughs> but anyway, y'all, um, it does come in a lot of specialty colors and this is the color. I have the color that's here on the stock card. So let me go ahead and try to style her y'all and I'll be right back in just a moment. Music up, you know 
we don't give a what on our way, yeah. We're on our way, yeah. Okay, y'all, I am back. <clears throat> Excuse me, I have her on and I have styled her. So let's just do a quick recap before I really just talk to you about her. But you know what? I think, you know, I think she's good. I think she's good. So this is uh, wig is by Bobby Boss. She is a synthetic uh, wig, as you, of course, already know. I have her in the style uh, Yannika. Well, she's MLF 720 Yannika and in the color TTHL 414613. Um, this is uh, this wig has a middle part. She is um, the part is 3.5 inches deep or three and a half inches deep. Um, she does have natural looking baby hairs and she comes in a lot of specialty colors. This wig does come with HD lace and it has the Medi Fresh cap underneath, which I've already shown you. So y'all. One thing, the best thing for me about this wig is, of course, the color. I am really into the lighter colors for the hotter months. I think they're more flattering on me. And so if you, you are like me and you prefer the lighter colors or you're kind of getting into the lighter colors, I do recommend this color. Um, I love this length and I don't feel like she's too heavy or too full for the summer months. So I'm, that's a good one for us. Um, I do like the cut. Um... I like the cut. She's sort of like a bob, but she's not like an asymmetrical bob. She is shoulder length uh, wig. And let me put on my glasses, y'all. I don't see how long she is, but she, as you can see, is a nice natural length. So she's not too long. I think that that's a good, you know, I'm a proponent of that. Um, she is heat safe. It does not say here how many degrees, but it does say she is heat safe. Um... This wig is supposed to be like a throw on and go. They are calling it a wear and go wig. So I don't know if this is a new line for them. I am a fan of Bobby Boss wigs anyway. I did go in and pull a little bit of the hairs out of the parting space to open it up just a little bit. You don't have to do that. You could just put powder in it. I did put powder in it as you saw me do. I uh, sprayed her just here in the front using my Even Wonder Lace Bond Spray in the Black Can. You should have seen me do that. And I didn't really, really use the baby hairs. I kind of brushed them over to the side, but, you know, they're there or you could just kind of push them back. Um, this hair is um, on the side is my hair. I have a very low hairline. I say that every time. Um, this wig, I did not experience a lot of shedding. There was some shedding because I plucked hair out of the parting space. So I think that that may have contributed to the shedding that I did experience. And I'm not really dealing with any tangling. She's not that long. Um, I do like the little swoops on the side. I think they're cute. Some people may not like that. I like the cuffing around the shoulders, I said, or the neck. I said that before when I came back and showed her to you directly out of the package. So, um, and the texture is beautiful. I don't feel like she's too um, shiny. She is a yakky texture. Um, I showed you how far she comes down on the sides for me. Sometimes I struggle with my side, the size of my head, not uh, a wig not fitting all the way down, but this one is nice and roomy. I didn't adjust her. I'm only using the combs in the back. I'm not using either of the combs at the front. I'm really trying to work on saving and preserving my edges. So um, I'm not using that, but this wig is fitting very comfortably and roomy on my head. I don't feel like it's, I feel like it's big head friendly. It's not too big, whereas, you know, my head is swimming around, but it was not too tight or difficult for me to get on um i'm gonna turn around and let y'all see it because i don't really have too much more to say about her but this is how she looks on the side here she is in the back and here she is on this side So I think she's a nice natural length. Again, she's shoulder length. She's not like an asymmetrical bob or anything like that. So they've got these soft layers and it's almost like, you know, they're kind of cuffed around your face, but I feel like the highlights make it look so pretty. It's very face framing and very flattering around the face, um, but they have some nice different colors if you're kind of into those kind of colors. But for the most part, I think she is a win-win and she was very affordable. I want to say she was about $25, $26. This is a specialty color. I think it was an additional $2 for this color. I did pick her up on week types if I didn't mention that already. I'll try to remember to leave a link down below um, if you want to go to that website to purchase her from there. Um, I don't really have anything else to say, y'all. I think she is summertime fine. I think she is summertime ready. Um, yeah, she didn't have a lot of flyaways. Uh, yeah, I think I've talked about everything. So if you have anything, any questions that I maybe did not address, please feel free to leave them down below in the comment section. 
comment section. Let me know what you think. Even if you don't have something that you want to ask me, just tell me what you think about this wig and my videos. I really appreciate it. So I want to say thank you to y'all for coming back to visit me here in Miss PJ's place. I hope you like, share, and subscribe. Please share me with anyone that you think would like the kind of videos that I share on this channel for the mature lady. Please follow me on Instagram at PJ I am. And until another video, y'all, that's that.